hello guys uh, in this video I will tell you about playing sounds so for example if you want to play a sound when you hit some button how can you do that yeah, I will show you today or if some error comes when you are running your program and you want to play some sound so you know that the program is showing error I will show you today how you can play that sound so what I have is a sound file which is having the extension .wav wave file and when I play it you have mail you see it's you have mail it's uh, playing some sound for two seconds it says you have mail so I will incorporate this sound in my Java program and I will try to play this sound file with the use of java program so let's get started what I will do first is I will take a button for example and I will name it as sound and I will and it its title also sound and I will right click it go to event action action perform and I will come to its action perform method now what I will do is I will write input stream sorry that's not what I wanted to write input stream I will name it as in and add semicolon so I have taken some import stream variable and after that I will make a try catch block try try catch and exception e I'm not going to write any exception or I will copy the exception like this so I made a try catch block here and in the try catch block you will write in which is this variable in is equal to new file input stream yes and then I will close the bracket and then semicolon in here in the bracket I will write once again new file and one bracket and in this bracket I will give double quote here. and in here you have to provide the path of the file so what I will do is I will go to my file I will go to its properties security and I will copy the whole path and then I will paste it here 
the file path and you know what to do just add double slashes okay in the next you will write audio stream is equal to or I will give some name variable name I will name it as audio s for example is equal to new I will copy it and just paste it here new audio stream and bracket and bracket closed and this in variable will go in between here okay and if some error comes here I will tell you afterwards I will finish the code then I will tell you so after that you write audio player dot player dot, dot start and in between this start bracket here what you need to do is copy this audio s variable and paste it here okay so I think your code is come and if you face some problem or the program shows some error then you need to import a file I will show you which file you need to import go here and generally it requires these two imports import sun dot audio dot star and import java dot io dot star so if your program is showing some error then just import these two files and now I will run my program and see that it works or not and this is my sound button and when I click it I should hear you have file e sound so I'm clicking it you have mail you have mail you have mail see so when I click the button it plays some sound so this is very uh, useful when you are making some program and you want to play some sound when you run the program or some error also this will help you and the important th thing to remember here is it only plays the dot wave file or dot wav file so keep in mind and everything will be good to go I hope you have learned something new this time. Please rate, comment and subscribe and bye for now.